in this video let us understand how to make tours and travels ticket booking also you can give the title tours and travel reservation so it's a web application project here we will understand how to create this project in asp.net with c sharp and backend sql server so we are know tours and travels is a quite big business and it present in every city therefore this project will have a wider scope so we need to understand what are the things we need to cover in this what are the modules we need to make and how this will helpful for the tours and travels company to serve their purpose if you doing cs course that is a computer science course and you need to do a project as per your curriculum so it may be a mini project or a major project or web application project and in this video we'll try to explain you all the things how you can make this project and what are the modules is required all will be covered in this video first let us discuss about the modules so what are the also you click on iblix tutorials then you click on videos here you can have a different project videos so if you need to do a project watch few more videos and check which one is good for you and you can have a discussion with your friends so then you can choose the right project for you and then you can also write this project in a different languages too like php or python or java jsp so all is possible so when you have a time please go through them this is not only for your curriculum it also help you for your job because if you complete the project you will have experience and here we'll explain lot of concept therefore it definitely will help you in a interview so you also have interview questions answers all this provided here in this channel so therefore we have time so please browse all the videos and check which are the one you are interested and watch and then learn now we'll move on so we'll go to visual studio here here you can see tours and travels this is the website and these are the pages right and the other side we have a server explorer here you can see the tables so these are the tables which are using in this particular project now if you take to admin main page so here are all the options you can enter the city names we can see the list you can enter the vehicle type you can see the corresponding list and individual vehicle details that list also you can see then the trip details and the corresponding list and the trip schedule when this particular trip will be take place and the uh, list and the other side we have a customer list booking list payment list and the cancelled list if you go to customer customer main page here are the option vehicle list trip detail list book trip booking list and the cancel trip now we'll see that how the whole project works so we'll run the project so it'll take to the main page so this is the local host 50 this is the port number and click here to continue so first we'll go to admin login so we'll log in with the admin credentials if you enter the wrong password you should tell us okay so this is wrong and you can't log in so if you go to list we already answered as mumbai mysore all the cities here for more cities you have to go to city names and then two fields are there here we have to enter this so when you enter the data so it'll go to corresponding table city table so here you have a place name so therefore if you say show table data here you can see that so the entry what you do it should come to this particular table fine so next one is the vehicle type so here we have uh, tata sumo then if you have different vehicles we need to enter all the vehicle types here then the individual vehicles so there is one vehicle we entered here but you can keep on enter the different vehicles what are the vehicles we are having so that you need to enter even you can provide the picture too like then important one trip so if you go to list so there is one south india seven day trip so number of days okay so days are provided here the next one is schedule actually when this trip will happen okay so now we'll make a new schedule so we'll go to this and this is the vehicle going to use uh, start date uh, let's say we'll take first 6 okay so let's say july 2021 
so number of days it is a seven days uh, then what is the cost okay it's cost around 45000 rupees per person instructions so it is a seven day trip uh, bring necessary cloth so you can write more instructions if you need to provide the instructions to the customer now the schedule is uh, created new schedule is done now customer can log in and they can book this trip so we'll continue so customer login if you don't have a login id you have to sign up here okay so if you have an id you can uh, log in with the id so they can see the vehicle list what are the vehicles they are having uh, trip detail list what are the trips are there next is the book trip so here if you search so you can have it schedules here so this is the one uh, the next trip so therefore you can select this number of seats how many seats you want if you want one you can book so if you want two you can uh, book through so now how do you make the payment so this is the dummy payment so indicate you that you're going to make the payment so payment detail uh, paid using can card uh, transaction number then remark so any remark is there you can write here inform in advance so before going to trip they need to inform you so that's the logic so now that is done so your booking number is 1002 now booking list so you can see that your booking is reflecting here same way if you go to admin here you can go to booking list so you can see that the booking list is coming here and payment list you can see the payment this is 45,000 credit card so you can cross verify and ensure that this money is reached, reached to your account right in case of cancel so they can do the cancel if they don't want the trip for example if you want to cancel this trip whatever you are booked now so you need to select this indicating that you are cancelling the trip now if I refresh this page you can see that one more cancellation is there so the customer cancelled the trip so here these are the options which are there in the customer and these are the options which are provided for the admin both should work properly so proper linking proper data display proper communications all is very very important so now you can also check what are the data you already entered is reach the table so you can see that uh, there is a trip details okay here it is show table data okay so this number of days 49 is there okay let me change to 7 and there is a corresponding picture here and now whatever you booked here if you go to show table data so it is there here okay so this is the booking number this is the date trip number seven day and this is the amount here is the a1 right so here is the status cancelled see indicating it's cancelled that's how uh, we can enter the data data go to the tables fine so hope you understand the concept now and how to make out of the pro options you need to provide all this we have separate videos like how you can create a login page how to enter the data how to create the database different videos are provided in our channel so please go to this channel and when you have time browse them and then learn step by step for example you want to design the website or you want to learn c-shop project or you want to learn vb.net project so please browse them step by step so therefore uh, you'll understand the whole concept to make the project thank you